Here on terra firma and planet Earth, great clouds. This is over the Dallas. These are Alto Cumulus Castellanus, Castellanus as in castle. They look like castles floating through the sky there and a great sunset to boot. So it was really a beautiful day. And I guess the most important thing about today is that it has cooled off after a high of 92 today. The overnight low last night was 68 in Portland. Had that stood, it would be a new record hot overnight low. And in Scappoose, they never dropped out of the 70s by this morning, but they have now. It's down to 62 in Scappoose, 65 in Portland. So our current temperatures are our lowest temperatures of the day so far. And we've got another 40 minutes to cool off a little bit. Already in the 50s in McMinnville, 50s at the coast, still hot in eastern Oregon with 70 in Hood River, 84 in Pendleton as they're hanging on to the heat after a triple digit day there. Thunderstorms fired up east of the Cascades, the marine layer west side. Now thunderstorms moving up through southeastern Washington there, and Oregon has pretty much been left behind with the thunderstorms, which is great. The cool air from the Gulf of Alaska is edging closer to us. That will ensure that the marine air keeps flowing into western Oregon and keep us out of the 90s. Now, thunderstorm threat pushed eastward for tomorrow. There may be a few random ones popping up in the northeast mountains, as you can see there, but not a lot. We're going to have some morning clouds. Then it clears off. We end up with a beautiful, beautiful day. Once again, we've got several of them coming our way. Now the modeling showing a little drizzle or some light rain on the coast on Saturday morning, maybe Sunday morning as well. But that's it as far as rain goes. And I don't think we see anything here in the Western Valleys as we maintain a really great summer weather pattern with morning clouds, occasionally afternoon sun and nothing too hot. So cooler this weekend as the system blows on through and then next week it'll warm up again, but it should remain mild enough. I still don't see us getting back into the 90s for quite a while. Look at the hour by hour forecast for tomorrow. 65 at 10 o'clock by noon. We're only at 70. We don't even reach 80 until about 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Remember, we've been well into the 90s the last couple of days at that time. It is 65 right now. The wind's beginning to settle down, which is great. So all in all, a beautiful night and a beautiful forecast. The breezes have one, uh, ended basically. Clouds in the morning, then sun with a high about 82 tomorrow. We'll get a little warmer on Thursday and Friday, 85, then 87, then back off again as we go into Sunday and Monday. Great weather for the thorns. They're back at home on Saturday. The timber's back at home on Sunday. So again, quintessential Portland summer weather, guys.